Hi everyone, I'm DJ Henry and you're watching the Inspired Cafe where we talk about faith, art, beauty, and life. Today I'm drinking my detox tea. This is my tea that I'm drinking. It's triple leaf tea, detox cleansing and revitalizing, and it's made with Chinese herbs to help the skin. I didn't realize that it was specifically for skin when I bought it. I just bought it because I wanted a detox tea. But I have been noticing my skin has been a little bit better. I haven't been breaking out as much. I've been drinking it for a couple weeks. And I don't know, this is me without makeup. But I guess you don't really ever see me too much without makeup. So it's not really anything to compare it to. But I don't know. I could do a little bit better with the dark circles under my eyes, but I don't sleep very good. And I don't sleep a lot. I don't get a good night's sleep ever. Anyway, so I just got done working out and I got the Focus T25 workout from Beachbody and I found out about it by watching Mommy Tips by Nicole. I found her on Instagram and then I found her videos and I was really intrigued by it because it's only a 25 minute workout. And uh, I was like, I could do that. I could commit to 25 minutes. So I got it. And when I opened the package, I was really, really excited. I, I got it on Friday while I was working on my daughter's birthday party. So I really couldn't get to it. So I said, Monday is gonna be the start date. And I really liked it because when I opened the product, there wasn't a lot of stuff in it. I got P90X a few years ago when it first came out and there was so much stuff. And there was like so much to do to prep to start the program. And then when you did the program, then the workouts were like an hour to hour and a half. And to tell you the truth, it's just like really, it's just really hard to stay consistent with something like that. Even though the workouts are good and they do work and I actually really love the Kempo workout. It's one of my favorite workouts. But I really just need something I can stick to. And 25 minutes, I think I can stick to that. I also decided to get Shakeology because I was thinking about juicing and I just wanted to get a program where I know that I'm doing everything that I can to get the best results. And the other thing I noticed was my hair is getting thin. Oh my gosh. Like, I know it looks, it looks like I have a lot, but it's, it's curly, so it masks it. And really up here, it's like really thin. And I'm always embarrassed, like I don't wanna show anybody, but it's thin up here. And I, I feel like I must not, I feel like it's because I'm not getting enough nutrients, honestly, because my appetite's been going down. I don't wanna eat a lot. When I wanna eat, it's not always the best food. Like I try to eat salads and things, but I really think that I need to do something more. And um, Shakeology is supposed to have a lot of antioxidants, nutrients, like it's supposed to be, have a lot of, it's supposed to be nutriently dense. Is that a word? Yeah, like, I don't know. So what I really liked is it's simple, like it's really simple. There's a calendar of recipes. I didn't realize you could do so much with a shake. So they have all these recipes where you can just add fruit and vegetables and almond butter and just different things. And it, apparently it's its own program, but I'm coupling it with the T25 program, which it's, it just seems so much more simpler. Like you just start the workout, you take your pictures, and the nutrition book is, this is a nutrition book. Um, with P90X, they had like all these things you could do. Like they had, if you're if you're this kind of person, do this diet. If you want to do this, do this diet. This this diet. And to me, it was too much. I'm a person that if I have too many options, I can get really overwhelmed. So the things that are required for the meals aren't extravagant or weird. I mean, I might even just have them. So. I'm excited about that. I did the workout today. I, I'm going to check Barely Made It. That's my calendar. I just put it up. Put it up. I'm gonna put it a little lower. So over the years, I've been trying all these different 
things to try to get this last 20 pounds off, but um, I really need to stay accountable. So Nicole is actually going to be my coach and I'm going to post as much as I can. At least once a week, I'm going to post about my workout. What I would love to do, this would be my dream, is to do like a 30 second recap every day after my workout. I'm just going to try to do it five days a week. Or six. How many days? Yeah, you do it five days a week, and I like to do a little recap and then compile those into a weekly vlog. We'll see. We'll see if that works, <clears throat> but I need to stay committed. I, I've noticed over the years, like, my weight has not gone down significantly, but my size has gone down, but I really would like to see a decrease in my weight and my body fat percentage, and I don't think that I'm extravagant with my weight loss goals because I know at some point you need to be like look at your body fat not your weight but I'm not there yet I know I'm not because I'm 20 pounds heavier than when I got married so and then when I got married I wasn't even I was in really good shape but I was not doing gymnastics so I know I was even in better shape so I know that gymnastics and having had three kids and 12 almost 12 years of marriage I want to just find the middle right there. 